Um, Trent, talk a little, for the folks that are out there that are listening on Sports Radio 810 right now that might not be familiar with uh, the Lucas Oil MLRA late models. Uh, this is a regional act. It, it was established by uh, Cowboy and Harriet Chancellor. Did a great job, but Lucas Oil has sent since bought that series and it's now managed by dan robinson the promoter at down at lucas oil speedway just talk about the series and the kind of cars and the talent that people will see there on friday night well the series started back in 1989 it's one of the longest uh tenured dirt late model sanctions in existence um in, in the country today it's had a huge huge uh, amount of success over the course of its uh its existence uh these are Super late models, all aluminum engines, 800 plus horse. Um, there's not really a whole lot of rules to the cars. They obviously have some body rules and um, some, some other rules. You Safety know, they, they rules on a, right. uh, mm-hmm. on a big wide Hoosier tire, but it's a it's a pretty unlimited class of car, um, and and they're they're certainly exciting. They, uh, uh, they obviously the, the goal in all dirt racing is to fight for traction. These cars have a lot of traction. They have mm-hmm. a big tire. Uh, and it really allows them to carry a lot of speed. They're they're very exciting race cars. Yeah, Trenton. Uh, when when you talk about late model racing, the speeds. If people have been out there for a local show and they've watched some A mod and some B mod action, but maybe they haven't been out there for one of these big late model shows, they're going to be impressed by the speed of these cars. You talk about the horsepower and how they get that applied to the ground and the tires and everything, but uh, uh, the amateur eye can see the difference in the speed of these cars when they rip around the track. Well, certainly, and and obviously, you know, the sprint cars, the fastest things that run on dirt. I would say uh, a super dirt late model is probably second. Uh, can, uh, hey, hold on. Faster than the modified. M- mark the tape right there, real quick for me. Okay, just go ahead. All right, go I ahead. I didn't say the best. I said <laughs> the <first. laughs> All right, DB, go ahead. Tell, uh, but uh, again, uh, the drivers, the quality of the drivers. Talk about some of the the talent that we're going to see on Friday night. Sure, Terry Phillips is leading the point standings. This will be MLRA's thirtieth race at Lakeside. So, you know, there, there's a long history yeah. uh, dating back many, many years at Lakeside. Um, Terry Phillips comes in leading the point.